Hi guys, it's Mark Zickery of Space Command, also known as Mr. Sci-Fi. And um, there's some amazing things happening, and I want to talk about how we could actually get the first 35 minutes of the two-hour Space Command pilot done and to you in the, in the next few months. It's an amazing opportunity. Uh, a lot's been happening. I had a great meeting yesterday with Mark Stern, who is now uh, head of television for I Am Global, which is a huge worldwide uh, TV company. And uh, Mark Stern used to be the president of the Sci-Fi Channel. He oversaw Battlestar Galactica, the Stargate TV series. He and I go way back. It was a wonderful meeting. We really saw eye to eye on things. So I'll talk about that and some of the other things that are happening regarding Selling Space Command as a series in another video. But what's going on right now is that the, I mentioned before that the VFX team that did our wonderful trailer, that if I just sell seven shares, I can get them to do the entire first 35 minutes of the Space Command pilot, the two-hour pilot. And I want to talk a little bit about that because I've been having conversations with our investors. I talked to a couple in Alaska. They can commit to two shares in April. So that leaves just five shares. And so I'm very eager to get this thing going. We could literally have the first 35 minutes done in the next three months. And once the 35 minutes are done, I'm going to send it to our backers, I'm going to send it to, to everyone who's put up money for Space Command because that seems appropriate. So, um, and, and But I want to tell you a little about what's in that first 35 minutes because it's an amazing section of the Space Command story and the Space Command dream. I'm not going to give spoilers per se. I'm just going to give you a little bit of a taste spoon. Uh, those of you who have been following our journey know a lot of this detail, but I just wanted to go into it a little bit first. So in that 35 minutes, we get to meet our main characters. We meet Mira Furlan, who plays Dr. Vaughn Adara, and her daughter as they're heading to Mars toward an archaeological dig that unlocks secrets that set our story going in, in, a, in a phenomenal and incredibly mysterious and wonderful way. We meet Jack Kemmer, our hero, who saves Mira and her daughter and then becomes central to their journey and their story. He, in turn, goes back to Earth. He sees his parents again, including Mike Harney, who plays his father. Mike Harney's on Orange is the New Black, as many of you know. Then we swing out to a mining colony in the asteroid belt, and Doug Jones plays a synthetic, Dorn Nevin. Doug, of course, was the alien on Falling Skies. He was in Penn's Labyrinth. He's just been cast in the lead in the new Star Trek TV show, Discovery. But that does not uh, in any way interfere with him being in Space Command, because, again, uh, TV shows have such a smaller run now that there's a lot of opportunity for actors to do other other roles and other stories in the uh, in the cracks in between, and so we're so in fact I'm writing the third Space Command story now, rewriting it, and Doug will f figure prominently in that one and in the fourth one and, and onward. So um, and so so Dor Nevin, Doug Jones. Uh, is, is a synthetic working in, the, in a mining colony in the asteroid belt. And Robert Picardo from Star Trek Voyager and Stargate Atlantis is Yusuf Sikander, is his human overseer, and they come together in a very dramatic way and become friends and embark on an adventure that will bring them together with our other characters. So that's all in the first 35 minutes. So it's Mars, Earth, the, 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 the asteroid belt, amazing action sequences, amazing uh, moments of human heart, and, and, and where we get into these characters and learn who they are and take the journey with them. So I wanted to share that with you. And so if we can sell five shares at 7,500 bucks each, we can pull the trigger and get this going. And within three months, you'd have 35 minutes in hand. So it's a very exciting thing. Uh, we're working on the next crowdfunding campaign. We're going to launch that in February. But we, this could be all well on its way by then. So, um, so if you've been thinking of investing in Space Command, now would be a great time. Additionally, we have a Patreon page. Uh, you can you can invest that way if you, if you want to put in less money because obviously, rather than selling seven shares, if just a, a, a few hundred backers just put in a little money each, that would do it too. So, so that's it for now. I just wanted to talk to you. I wanted to share this with you. I wanted to let you know what's possible and what we can all do together. So, and oh, before we leave, I just wanted to let you know that there's someone else who, uh, who has a special word for you as well. So that's it for now. Talk to you soon. Hi, I'm Michael Mankin, director and producer of such shows as Battlestar Galactica, Defiance, Caprica, most recently, The Exorcist, and I'm here to talk about Mark Zakri. If you're even watching this video, you're part of the team. It means that you believe, as we do, that, that the storytelling that is positive and presents a view of the future that we can all strive for uh, is, is something that you want to see. And together as a team, we can bring that to the world. You know, television, television and movies are the loudest voice that human beings have ever had. And Mark and his team and all of us feel that 
with that power comes responsibility. And Space Command is a big step in reclaiming the responsibility of storytelling in using this medium to make the world a better place.